After the melt has stopped flowing from the die and the downstream equipment has been shut down, move the roll stack away from the die so the face of the die can be cleaned. Be careful, the die is very hot and also you don't want to scratch the die lips. Wear insulating gloves. If the die is going to remain in use, a feed leader may be left depending on your procedures. Any scrap that has purged to the floor should be removed. If the die is going to be removed from the extruder for cleaning or maintenance, this should be done when it is hot. Each plant should have procedures in place for removing and handling dies. Die stands, transfer tables, and or cranes are often used, depending upon the weight and size of the die. When lifting dies, always use the lifting lugs, which are designed to keep the die in a balanced position. To clean the die, first make sure the electrical power is off. Then you can loosen all the body bolts. Next, use jack bolts to split the die apart. When the die is split, lift the die half off the dowel pins. Use a soft brass tool to scrape out the hot plastic in the flow channel. After the plastic is scraped out, the flow channel is polished.